Lara, are you okay? Oh, thank God. Anna, what? What are you doing here? I don't know. I can't remember. What's happening, Lara? I'm scared. I'm so sorry. I didn't think they'd come after you. This is all my fault. Who? Who were they? What did they want? The same thing my father was after. Oh no, Laura. I told you not to do this. Whatever they want, just give it to them. It's not that simple. Just hold on. I'll get us out of here. Somehow. She doesn't know. What? You... No. You're with them! I can't believe this. You... You... Come on! You couldn't let it go, could you? I knew you'd find your way to this place. What did you expect? It doesn't have to be this way. We seek the same thing. We could use someone like you. You want a purpose in your life? We can provide that. You've got to be kidding. I've seen how Trinity operates. Is that a no? It's a no fucking way! Tell me, Anna. Were you recruited by Trinity before or after you started screwing my father? I loved Richard. But he was blinded by idealism. And it destroyed him. What would you do with the artifact? Show it to the world. Redeem your father's good name. You're still so naive. Just a frightened little girl trying to walk in her daddy's shoes. We're done here. No. Not yet. You and I... We can still be on the same side of history. Think about it, Laura. How to be. I thought I was alone. So did I, but here we are. So what should I call my new acquaintance? Nothing. I won't be staying. Constantine has little patience. Nor do I. So I see. 
Nice trick. Can you get us out of here? There's no us. I don't even know who you are or why you're here. Sorry. I'm not feeling particularly trusting right now. You won't get far without me. <laughs> you don't know how far I've come. What do you know about them? A set. Ancient and secretive. They believe themselves to be doing the work of God. From what I've seen, they're pretty far from holy. And what do you plan to do with that? I'll let you know when I think of it. All the more reason to get out of here. Is there a way out? No, but I found something that might be useful. Don't want to attract attention. It worked. Can you get out? Wait. Let me out. I can help you. I can't trust you. We may not be enemies. I can see that. I suspect you do too. I work better alone. I know the layout. I know the land. I'm a fast learner. I have no doubt of that. Maybe I can offer you something more valuable. I know what you're all after. Jacob. Lara. Take this. In case we get separated. We have to move. The guards will be coming through on rounds any moment. Do you know the way out? Yes. I've had some time to study this place. How long were you in that cell? Long enough to learn that Constantine won't stop until he's found what he's looking for. The Divine Source. Is it here? <laughs> Trust must go both ways, Lara. What is this? A history lesson. This place has its own scars. I've finally laid my betrayals bare. Lara knows the truth. Now a strange series of emotions has gripped me. Remorse, certainly. Remorse for a piece of me that was left inside that torture cell. But something else, too. I know Constantine thinks that I've lost my edge, that my time with the Crofts has made me soft, but he's wrong. It isn't softness. It feels instead like a new kind of resolve. I knew Lord Croft to be an intelligent man, I know his daughter holds secrets in her head. As an ally, she'd be invaluable. As an enemy, she'll be a difficult problem. I must make sure that Constantine's arrogance doesn't get the better of him as we take her on. It was a work camp.
best chance of escape is to make our way to the old train yard. And what then? My village is in the valley on the other side of the mountain. We will be safe there. Command post two, last chopper outbound. Roger. That'll be the last ship. Report some trouble at the communication depot. More than this. We caught an armed intruder from the outside. Some woman. She stirred up the trouble on the perimeter. Are we expecting others? Pot. wants to team up at the copper mill before the storm sets in. God damn it, it is fucking freezing in this place. I should have brought my damn cold weather gear. <gasps> Handles fused. Almost got it. Surprised any of this shit still works. Looks like this was the living room. We've got company! Hmm. Mid, check it out. You like that? Copy that thing.
Jacob, I found a way to open the inner gate. Head to the courtyard. I'm already inside. I need to get in there. to leave this frozen hell. Then I have good news. Reconnaissance from the scouts. The natives have a settlement on the other side of the mountain. Soon, you will have your day. We both will. Just as long as you don't lose focus again. What do you mean? You're sentimental about her. The Croft girl, I can tell because she's still alive. We can't afford to dwell in the past. You doubt me? You know what I've given to Trinity. What I've sacrificed. What I face. <coughs> I'm fine. Life has not been kind to either of us. But I swore I'd always protect you. Now who's being sentimental? I promise you. All of this will be worth it in the end. With the Divine Source, you will live. But more importantly, you will live in a world cleansed of sin. Send your men to this settlement. Find out what they know. It's too dangerous. Let me have my pleasures. None of this will matter. The day our work is accomplished. Constantine, you're needed in the holding cells. We're in this together, sister. Remember. Always. Mankind shall be judged, the non-believers turned to ash and swept away, and the pure of faith will be raised up and given life eternal. Get out! I'll find you! You've got to find them! Keep looking! They have to be here somewhere. 
somewhere. All right. We've got to find a way out of here. On my way. Strange being in the field again. I was undercover for so long, locked in a life of comfort at Croft Manor. Here, there is no comfort at all. The air is frozen, the food is canned and cold. The company, aside from Constantine, is abysmal. But I asked to be here. I need to be here. I do not have the luxury of time or patience. Constantine and I begin this journey together. I will be there when he fulfills his destiny. So for now, I'll breathe deep. I'll let the cold air burn my lungs. I'll let it remind me that I'm still alive. And let it fuel me for the final push towards our destiny. Damn. Got to get out of here. A military patch for Trinity soldiers. Aside from the design, there's no identifying techs. They keep themselves hidden, even from their own foot soldiers.
As we push deeper into the valley, I find myself staring at the ruins and pondering my own mortality. These structures have been here for ages, waiting for this moment. I can feel their anticipation. The stone itself wants us to succeed. And what is there to stop us? Non-believers, the fearful, and the lost. Those that hid the source from Trinity for so long. We are the very people who would use what's hidden here, as it was intended to be used. This world is too corrupt, too rotten, too sick to be saved by any means other than Trinity. We will have our army. A righteous man will lead it. Constantine will be that man. Soviets came looking for it too, 
And now Trinity and Anna. Anna. God. I still don't quite believe it. All this time. Did she watch Dad as well? I've got to keep moving. Find Jacob and join his people. If I can prove myself to them, maybe he will tell me more about this place.
As we push deeper into the valley, I feel reassured that this is the work I was chosen to perform. My stigmata itch with sensation. It is a constant reminder of my higher purpose, of my singular position in this higher purpose. I was a child, innocent to the evils of the world. Then, one night, I woke in such pain, a scream on my lips. Blood dripped from my palms when I saw it. I was terrified. It marked me. It meant something. I cannot shirk this mission any more than I can shirk. Jacob, I think I'm close to the train yard. Are you there? So long. I thought I lost you back there. Not a chance. Thanks for getting me out of that place. Let's move! We can get up through there! Watch out!
take it easy. Drink this. It'll help. You could have left me in that river. Would you have left me? I'd have thought about it. <laughs> what makes you think I didn't? What makes you risk so much to come here? The Divine Source. I know what you're looking for. But I want to know why. When I was young, it was just my father and I. He was an archaeologist, too. In his last years, he was... obsessed with myths about immortality. Of course, no one believed him, including me. Our last conversation was a fight he... He took his own life. I thought I'd come to terms with it, but... Something else happened. And I saw something that I thought was impossible. It changed everything. I realized my father was right. He died alone and broken. But he died for something. So you believe the Divine Source is real? I honestly don't know. But if there is any truth to it, I have to find out. It, it needs to be researched and studied. It could make a difference to the world. It's not something to be hidden away. A difference is not always for the best. Would you wish Trinity to have the secret to immortality? Of course not. Then I would ask you not to abandon your quest, but to alter its path. Join me and my people. Help us repel Constantine and Trinity. Then after that's done. And you leave our valley untouched. But knowing that you've done the right thing, no. I'm sorry. I can't do that. Can't. Or won't. I'll fight Trinity with you, but my goal remains the same. If I give up now... You'd feel like you'd be letting him down. Not just him. I need answers, Jacob. I need to understand. You're leaving. Right now, my concern is for my village. It's over the mountain pass. A day's journey on foot. But there may be a faster way through the old copper mine. You rest. I'll be back soon. <laughs>